Dude, I didn't even realize until the Patreon comment pointed it out from last episode, but that is Dimple at the very end of the last episode, having those people cheer for Mob and like worship Mob. And it's like mind games to the max. So shout out Triple Set on Patreon for pointing that out. And yeah, we're, I think we're gonna have a confrontation this episode between our boy Mob and Dimple. Dimple having sort of lost it with power in terms of trying to take over the entire city, he pretty much has. But Mob remains unbrainwashed and he's heading in to confront him. If you need a channel, don't forget to drop a sub and let's hop into it. Psycho helmet, son. Oh man, Mob has no even inkling yet. Oh, even yeah. Subami, man. He is really trying to get into his head, though. It's more than broccoli. It's life itself. Yo, what is Dimple's, like, end goal here? Like, actually just take over the world? In true mob psycho fashion, though, it happens so quickly. Reincarnation. What, of mob? Mob is technically the creator. Against their will. He's just climbing. <laughs> At least he admits it. He's getting close. God, it is really pretty in here, though, I will say. <gasps> There's two! What happened? He looks fine. God, dude, Temple has to be really strong. Let's take Terror down. He's got a lot strong. I mean, all the energy from all the people, too. Oh, he does know. Okay, so I think he had like a, a general idea that it was Dimple, but just didn't want to say it until he 100% knew because Mob makes these confident decisions. He isn't going to like quadruple guess everything anymore. He's just going to take it as it comes. Oh, this is the first time we've heard his like normal Dimple voice while in here. You already asked him, Dimple. He said no. These your friends. It's just gonna be a fight between them. Everybody's under his control. And we're not even halfway through the season, bro. Dimple has brainwashed the entire city. Like, how are we already in a worse state than last season? Some, like, technically. You mad? Brainwashed freedom is not freedom. Oh my gosh, world domination. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Yeah, there's a brick wall here. They're not going to agree. Sentimental and narrow-minded. I mean, technically you do, though. This is a very crazy test for Mob. Because he could have the perfect world. Where everybody loves him and he's at the top. This is his biggest test yet. But it's not real life. And he knows that. You stand his ground. Yeah. And Mob has, has followed his heart. That's what he's got. The point he's gotten to. I don't think he wants to resort to force. Yeah. What else is he supposed to do? He's tried to talk no Jutsu to him. He's been trying to talk to him. Yes! Oh, wait. Oh, no. Now he really is the last one. Dude, is he going to have to fight off terror, too? That's so unfair to say you're choosing violence when Dimple did it against people's will, like, from the first place. That's literally Dimple saying that, basically. Oh, man. I'm more scared of the body improvement club, bro. Somehow they did take it a step up. I said last season... Dang! The real Dimple. Yeah, where's the actual Dimple? God, I'm so proud of Mob, though. Season 1 Mob would have been freaking out not knowing what to do. This Mob is so confident, and he's just been pushing forward, despite everyone being against him. It's, it's insane character development. And now he has to fight Terror again in the final season, the rematch, man! 
Mob's gonna explode, man. Do we knock him out? Terror doesn't stand a chance against Mob, bro. Mob wasting time, Temple. Temple's giving him more power, giving Terror more power. This is so evil. Making him fight Terror, like, he's gonna make him push him to the brink. I mean, he has so much power to work with considering he's draining everybody in the city. Jeez. And Dimple said this isn't this isn't him doing it, it's Terror doing it. It's just him brainwashed to another level. That's why I say it technically is Dimple. When in reality it's not him telling him to do it. This is how he feels now. It's the easy thing to do. It's to just give in and have this perfect world. It's draining him. Oh no. He's gonna try and detonate the whole tree. I mean, I feel like Mob has the power to destroy the whole tree. Unless Dimple puts his everything into protecting it. Dude, the colors are so beautiful. Oh! Dude, that giant explosion just opened a hole. And he just closes it right away. Oh my god, it's gonna be a battle of titans. Being a god isn't so easy when people disagree with you. See, Mo Dimple sees it as futile for Mob, but Mob sees it as futile for Dimple. Because neither of them is going to give up. Oh, this is so sad because I'm really... I'm, I'm not scared right now. I'm scared of how this ends. And where this, get this gets to. Because neither of them is going to give up. I don't want to have to see Mob kill Dimple. God! No, I don't think so. Is Dimple scared of Mob? I love these visuals of all these, these giant tree mobs, though. It's so cool. Just the low-key soundtrack. It contrasts very well. Gosh, dude. He's at like 90%, man. This is so sad, dude. I think Mob is starting... Okay, that is way too creepy. I think Mob is starting to realize what he might have to do. And I don't want that. I, dude, he definitely doesn't want that. I think that's why he's crying. He's tried to talk to him and he wants to talk to him still. That's why he's asking him to come out, I think. Is he clutching his heart? Or is it draining him? Oh, it is the root on his leg. Well, if Dimple gets his way, the mob still exists. This is not mob. But he wanted to talk to you as a friend. There he is. There he is, man. I hate the way his character is developed, though. Like, I really thought he had come, like, full circle in a sort of sense by just witnessing Mob as a, as a person. Get her? Oh, hell nah, dude. There's no way. I think that's the one thing I don't like about this. Is... I know Dimple always had that sort of evil intention. I was worried about that. But it feels like it's been all for naught, him being with Mob this whole time. I guess he got to know Mob and he knows his weaknesses. That's why he's bringing Subami in. Guys, huge! Oh my gosh, he's pulling out all stops. Oh, so the fact that she doesn't just jump right to Mob means she doesn't want him 100%? You don't know her, Dimple? Dude. Or maybe Mob's the one person that makes her shy. I hate this so much. His crossed arms. He doesn't care what you have to say. Good. Add a boy mob. I'm glad he's not even remotely getting to him. Oh. He just blew him away too. How does he even defeat him, Dimple? Oh. This is slapping him. <laughs> oh no! He's getting serious. He sounds like Blackbeard now. He will have his Blackbeard voice. God. He's still trying to slap some sense into him. He doesn't want to have to hurt Temple. 
Golden Frieza, bro. Easy. Oh my, that's a sick worm. Ooh, like the sound of like metal hitting him. Holy. Oh man, he seems way stronger and faster, especially since he's already drained some of them all, but he's about to hit 100%. And he's going to be uncontrollable at that point. That boy. Dude. <laughs> the whole. Every move is just godly something. Godly sandbag. He knows he's pushing him and he knows how Mob is. Once he finally snaps. Very aware. Yep, he knows him. He's known him this whole time. He has to get him there. Mm, so Mob is literally nerfed during this fight. What if that wasn't his limit though? Yeah, but he's grown so much since then. His mental is so much stronger. He was a different mob then. Even in his fight. It... You can't be serious. Even in his fight at the end of last season, he was still a different mob. Ooh. Ooh, his eyes. He knows the real Dimple. Ah, oh, dude, he better come back around. And that's why it made him mad, because he knows he's right. He knows Dimple's become better. Casually denying thing he wants whenever Dimple supported him. Dude! That looked insane! Oh, that sent into 100, 100%. That was what frustrated Dimble from the, the get-go, was Mob kind of brushing aside his ambitions. Oh, here we go. The soundtrack started. This is what I was saying. I don't think that was the, 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 the end of his powers last season. He is more than even we know. Yeah, he does scare Dimple. Scares me! Kind of sad that... Yeah. Yeah, he still has faith that Dimple can come back around. Oh, this is so sad. He's never been on his side, truly. Wow. Oh, dude. Wow, Mob really is ready to put him down, though. God, this fight is insane. The shirt! The monkey shirt! <laughs> no way that's what sends him over. Mob genuinely looked offended. Man, I'm so sad, like, just knowing that this might end with Dimple dying. And he, that it makes Mob sad, but I'm shocked that he's like, is this goodbye? But I think Mob is so fueled by emotions right now that if he does end up having to kill Dimple or just wipe him from existence in general, it won't hit him as hard until after the fact, when all the adrenaline has died down, when all the emotions are, like, lessened. And when he actually realizes what happened, because I think whenever he gets to this point of like a hundred percent, it's still mob, but I don't think he's completely like there. Does that make sense? But man, this fight is insane. The visuals for like the godly beam and stuff. Oh, dude. And Dimple's a final, final form. Uh, it's, it's just amazing. But again, I, I am still kind of frustrated with his character, but I guess if he's been trying to trick and trying to manipulate and use mob from the very beginning and he admits that, then it kind of adds some points back. But again, frustrating for the viewer. I just realized that on Crunchyroll, there they were like kind of sections in this season. And this is Divine Tree 3, as in three out of three, as in the last in this section. I am afraid. <laughs> Back to him getting the shirt. Yeah, what, what was he thinking, though? Like, leading him uh, with this shirt. See, like, Ritsu is realistic. Like, you can tell he doesn't like it. Nobody else like it. Why did Teru like it? Teru was just trolling him. Bro, the POV of the butt chin. No, really, what the F? <laughs> Starting to worry. I like how this is what turns the tides, bro. He's like, if I had been there, I would have told you not to. Wait, maybe that is what's happening. He's realizing his role in Mob's life. 
Or maybe not. Maybe he's just making Mob angrier. It's positive energy though. He had 100 positive percent, which you would have thought the opposite considering he's in a very stressful situation fighting against a, what I would say is a close friend. I think we're gonna find out a lot about him this episode based on how far Mob's pushing him. This is a big episode, dude. If there was one single episode of Mob that I haven't been able to predict, it would be this one prior to it. Cause I do not know how this will go. I'm... Yeah. Oh, but it was positive energy. He would have blown if it was negative. And he is still dark though. I don't think he was attacking you. Yeah. Maybe Mob's trying to show him something. Maybe that he doesn't want to. Oh. Or he's sad that he has to fight a friend like this. He doesn't want to have to use it. Maybe he's showing Dimple that Dimple means more to him than everybody else. Dude! Oh, he cut his hair! The bull! Did he really kill Mob? He knows he wouldn't. Oh, that's why he used it all up. To show that he doesn't want to fight. Yo! Oh, the smile! <laughs> Is that all what it led to? Oh my gosh! Yeah, how do we fix this? He wanted to make himself a villain and wanted Mob to like defeat him, I think. Mm. He got carried away and didn't know what to do? Ah, those cheeks! Yep, he realized he just brushed Dimple aside. He's being selfish. I think it's the first time in the whole series that Mob's been selfish. He went too far off on that end. What he wanted Mob to be with him for because he was important to him. Oh my gosh. So he's not right? I think you're getting goosebumps because he's right! Yeah. It doesn't feel right because he's actually listening to Mob. When old Dimple would have just been like, oh, whatever, man. Yeah. It, it, it was what he wanted out of life. It was his end goal. He's here. <laughs> Mob was the most important person to the temple. He's become the most important person to him. And when the most important person to him doesn't go along with his plan, then what does it matter? His reason for being was this goal, and he's here. So if he's not happy with it, what's the point? As your friend, but then he has to make a decision from there on what he's to do. Is he crying? That was the actual end goal. It's beautiful. That's it? Oh my gosh! He realized that Mob was all he wanted. Is <laughs> the dream is changed! <laughs> He's like, commit to something, Shigeo! <laughs> What a genuine laugh. Oh, my boys. Oh. He's going to give him like a piggyback ride. Man, I'm going to miss this form of dimples though. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it wrapped up that cleanly. And it just took Mob like just completely dispelling his powers. It makes sense. He didn't want to have to hurt him. He just wanted to talk to his friend and show him that he'd made a mistake. Oh. The giant broccoli. I wonder what the title means then. Dimple is. God, oh, this place is insane. 
観光スポットにもなれそうだった。いや、for real。why can't they leave it？ 人々は神秘的なものや圧倒的なものに魅了され。I mean, is it necessarily bad if some people have something to believe in？ 家に着いたら起こしてくれる。メシスカじゃねえぞこら。<笑>俺様をなんだ。Mob really actually like emptied himself。よだれ垂らすんじゃねえぞ。<笑> He actually is getting a big back ride。帰る場所なんてねえんだよな。Oh. 目的も失ったし。He doesn't seem too down about it、oh.。Hey, yo! That was so terrifying how it went silent! Oh my god, my heart like stopped! Has it become like. Self aware? Oh my god, that was terrifying! Good god! It just went dead quiet. Oh no! It is aware! It gained sentience! Oh my gosh! Oh no! And Mob is knocked out! That! How dare you! So, how powerful is this on its own? It doesn't think like a human, it's, it's literally just energy manifested. Oh gosh. <laughs> it barely even knows how to move! But it makes sense that it wouldn't, because, like I said, it's not even a human. It's gonna just try to, like, eat Mob? Does he mean sustenance by, like, the energy or, like, him, like, his body to just consume? Oh, God. This is somehow even scarier than the, the, the Mob and Devil fighting, because they could have actually worked it out. You're not gonna be able to talk to this tree! Who's protecting him? Give him hell, Dimple! Oh my god! Oh, this is the problem that Dimple has created inherently. Gathering all this energy together. He's gonna be the one to fix it. God damn! Oh my goodness. They all have godly beams! Oh, nah. Dog, I don't think Dimple nor Mob is strong enough to defeat all of these. Oh, the kick! Do they have to defeat him to get rid of the barrier on Mob? God, this is so cold, this fight. They're sucking him. Dude, that was like, that was like CG there for a second. Oh, the soundtrack! Oh my gosh! This is this design, this form of, of a god dimple is so sick against them. And the sound effects like the metal hitting? Holy. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh! Come on, dimple! You cannot fall here! Oh my gosh. Jeez, dude. He's in rough shape. Oh! The colors. Oh my gosh. It's all psycho helmets. Oh my god! He's they're gonna nuke the city! This this so gas! Just lying dormant, bro. Oh, my God, it's just cuts. Is this even temple? We don't get to see what he did. Oh, my God, 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 oh, Oh. My brainwashing. Wait, what? What is happening? Oh, he's back. Wait. What? You say his, his brainwashing would work? He's leaving. He said final orders. Maybe that he doesn't need to order him around.
帰りましょう皆さん帰りましょう That's so これが先ほど撮影されたのです一体何が起きているのでしょうか誰の仕業かわからないけど夕方ぐらいから記憶が曖昧なんだけどもしかして兄さんも同じ Nobody's gonna remember it I don't think even mob really does 僕も思い出せないどうやって Well it seemed like he realized it there But that he's not supposed to even speak about it This needs to エクボが詳しそうだよね今度聞いてみるよ He knows He does know <laughs> it's like I knew going to the episode that you might die, but not like that, dude. Not at all like that. I thought it'd be some moment, but like nobody even knowing, and Mob not even completely 100% knowing himself, but knowing that Dimple was a reason that everybody was saved. Like, yeah, it was the problem that he made in the first place, but oh my gosh, just him walking away and hearing just Dimple be just torn to pieces. Oh god. That was far and away the best episode of the series from just the emotions, from Mob's development, Dimple's development, the fight between Dimple and I guess Psycho Helmet. Oh, dude, they did not have to have Mob crying there at the end. That is so horrible but i'm assuming that is the end of dimple and he cleaned up the whole mess along the way took the tree and i guess put in the ocean dude and we still have half the season left and it's gonna be half the season without dimple and ritsu saying I'll, I'll i'll ask him whenever i see him but i don't know maybe i should hold out hope that there's some little inkling of him still left in the universe from just being obliterated and he could tease it later on but i won't get my hopes up too high guys that's been it for episode six of my mob psycho 100 season three watch through do drop a sub on the channel if you're new and i'll catch you in the next one is peace.